Hey everybody, it's me, BB Loss and H. And well, last episode we helped the Slowpoke, we defeated Proton, and now we're gonna enter the gym. So we got Zuku up front, and I got Bayleaf and um, Dark Knight up to level 17. So they're so of course Dark Knight learned um, Wing Attack. Wing Attack. Thank you, Tristan. Um, and now if we need any backup, um, Zubat can help us. So now we're gonna battle this trainer. Um, and I think Zuko will gain um, a decent amount of experience because, um, well, Zuko's a fire type and fire can be bug because it could burn them up and, you know, Die. destroy them. <laughs> um, so this guy's going to have a Caterpie, not a big problem for Zuko. Um, so let's go for an Ember. And I'm glad that when I got my, I actually got Zuko from my Gold game and I traded it into my Soul Silver game. Um... And I was actually pretty excited because I never used a Growlithe on my team, and I and I heard Arcanine was a really good Pokemon. And um, yeah, so um, I planning I'm planning to evolve Zuko um after the fourth gym after we defeat the fourth gym, so we could have him prepared um for. Can I say something? What? Um. Um. Does it? Caterpie have the same voice of Goldeen? Sort of. Um, I don't know. You might want to look like that up. They both go like Dee -doo. Um, I, I, I guess I'm not. I'm not sure, but I guess well, they do. I think I'm sure too. I and, don't um, think they're. I don't think. And Poliwag almost sounds like Ditto. Poliwag Ditto. What, Tristan? You're making a weird combinations here. Oh, I, I hear them. Anyway, so we're gonna battle this guy. Yeah, this guy. Uh, my brother, um, he wants to get Pokemon Soul Silver, and his team is gonna be Feraligatr, Gengar, um, Skarmory, Beedrill, um, Jolteon, Jolteon, and um, he wants Hitmontop, Hitmontlee, or Hitmonchan. Um, yeah, and, and I'm naming my new to this guy. this guy. Yeah, that guy. Okay, so um, Zuko's gonna get up a level, level 17. So um, the only one really to get up a level is um, Flaffy. Helping hand. Let's see. I don't think I don't think that's a good move. Yeah, I'm not gonna teach I think it. Oh yeah, Zuko does have roar, so that's pretty good. Keep all the moves. I told you like twice. <gasps> yes. Thank you. I've been telling you that. All right, so this guy's going to send in Kakuna, which is going to be pretty easy. So let's actually go ahead and send in Sokito. Sokito's always the one that's behind at levels. I don't get that, but whatever. I always like Sokita a level behind so she can have a challenge. Because she's my only girl on the team, and Zuko is a boy. I was actually pretty lucky it was a boy because I didn't want a girl and I didn't want to name it Zuko T. I mean Zuka. Zuka. I didn't want to name it Zuka. It was pretty like lame. So yeah. I actually named Zuko after um What's this guy's No, um Purple Rodri's Typhlosion. Purple Rodri's Typhlosion. So yeah, the B drill gets paralyzed. Wait, you're still attacking? Okay, hit two times. Uh, yeah, the Beedrill. Yeah, Beedrill. Okay, um, tell me, um, in the comments, can you tell me if Beedrill can learn fly? I don't think so, but whatever. Um, so yeah. Yay. I'm losing HP. Um, I think I did bring potions. I'm not sure. I'm probably gonna use them all before the gym. This gym's pretty hard if you don't have any flying or electric or rock. Or fire. So, or fire, same thing. Water? Is that good? Um, I don't know. I don't know if his Pokemon know any grass type moves. But if they do, um, you're in for, for a pretty bumpy ride. But this oh whoopsie, I got a little excited. Because this gym is awesome. Um anyways, um, so if you're having trouble um with this gym, go ahead and catch yourself a Geodude. And actually think about using it on your team because Geodude's a pretty good po actually, no, um, what am I saying? It's a good Pokemon. Um, yeah, we're forced to take this path, so there's going to be a double battle, so let's actually put up, um, I want to put Silo up front, I, let's try out Dark Knight, and I'm gonna just going to keep Silo in the bottom, so let's go. Rosalo's the backup. Yeah, um, Rosalo's backup, 
like for poisoning blue i don't know bug type pokemon can get poisoned but if they do that's pretty cool i guess um see so yeah, we're gonna battle this is our, actually our first double battle in the game so i'm pretty excited i really like double battles and in pokemon black and white they have triple battles and i will be doing rotation yeah and i will be actually doing oopsie sorry i will be actually doing um a review on um pokemon black 2 and white 2 so i'm really excited about that so let's actually use our new move from i would give away supersonic i didn't think i needed it because we're going to use learn confuse ray later so i really don't need it i really don't care all right so they gain different experience that's that's okay um all right so they have spinner died not really died, but like fainted. All right, so that was a actually a really easy battle. Not that difficult. Um, if you don't have a fire ground, ground. Uh, why did I just took on you again? I didn't mean to do that. Okay, so when you actually wait. Okay, whew, I thought we were actually going up, and I was like, wait a second, I'm not ready. Okay. Um, let's put Dark Knight up front. There. Okay, so when you press that lever, um, it's gonna, like, just lead you to that guy. Yeah, that guy. Alright, um, was there a level lever next to those twins? Yeah, there was a lever, and I did not push it. Ugh, this gym is, like, so complicated when you don't know where to go. Um, so he's just gonna have a Paras, and it's not a big deal if you have a flying type, so yeah. Hold on a second, guys, hold on. Anyways, so, um, yeah, I just, my brother wanted to tell me something, so yeah, that's all. Alright, so the Paras was pretty easy to kill, and as you know, Dark Knight takes a lot of experience to just get up one level, so really, um, I will not worry about him over-leveling. I always like my starter the highest level. I feel pretty bad when he's, like, the lowest level on my team, and I do not like that. So let's actually go back to those twins who I did not push the lever on. And hopefully I could push another lever so we can actually get to the gym and actually save it for next time. So, yeah. Alright, so let's see. Yeah, we have to push this lever. Okay, I don't know why these things couldn't go, couldn't have gone faster. It's just like, really, you're taking forever. Alright, so here's the gym leader, everybody. Bugsy, the girl. No, boy. just kidding. It's a boy. Yeah. I actually pressed this lever before anything. So, what I'm thinking of doing for the next episode, I'm thinking of actually putting Sokita up front. So, yeah. So, that's all for right now, guys. I will see you all next time. And please, please leave your comments. Give me a big thumbs up and subscribe.